I talk to God about how I feel. I talk to God about how I feel by Stormy O'Martin. God cares. Talk to him. God helps me. God loves me. Thank you. Pray to him. Give all your worries to him because he cares about you. All boys and girls have feelings. God made us that way. Grown-ups have feelings too, but they don't always show them to little kids. God cares about all our feelings. He cares about us when we are sad just as much as he cares about us when we are happy. He cares about us when we are lonely or mad just as much as he cares about us when we are worried or hurt or afraid. That's because God loves us no matter how we feel. Sometimes I feel lonely. Sometimes I feel lonely when people are too busy to spend time with me or read a book together or play a game. When my mom or dad have a lot to do and my brother or sister don't want to play and my friend can't come over, that makes me feel lonely. I'm glad God cares about how I feel because when I feel lonely, I talk to him and I draw a picture for him that I think he will like. Then I don't feel lonely anymore. What makes you feel lonely? Sometimes I feel lonely because I miss my friend. I once had a friend who moved far away. Now I don't see him anymore. Mom said it's good to miss him because it means that I cared about him very much. But it's not good to feel lonely for a long time. God says in the Bible that he wants to be my friend. He says he will never leave me. Dear God, thank you for being my friend. Please stay close to me so I won't feel lonely. Sometimes I feel afraid. Sometimes I feel afraid because I have, I have had a bad dream. When that happens, I call for my mom or dad or the person who is taking care of me. They always talk to me or tell me a story so that I will forget about the dream. When I feel scared, I pray to God and ask him to take away my afraid feelings. He always does. What makes you feel afraid? Sometimes I feel worried. Sometimes I feel worried about things. Being worried means I am thinking about something that might happen. I don't want it to happen. And maybe it won't happen. But it might. I worried a lot when my dog got sick and we had to take her to the hospital. I was worried that she might not get well, but she did. And she came home again. God says that we should not worry about anything. We should just talk to him instead. What makes you feel worried? There is one more thing I worry about. Every time I go to the doctor, I am worried 
that she might give me a shot. She doesn't always give me a shot, but I am worried that she might. Dad says shots only last four seconds, so I should just take a deep breath and count to four, and then it will be over. Dear God, I am worried that I might have to get a shot. I pray that I don't have to get one, but if I do, help me to count to four. Sometimes I feel mad. Sometimes I feel mad when my brother or sister or friend calls me a nickname that I don't like. My dad says they are just teasing me because they love me, but teasing makes me feel like they don't care about me. When I feel mad, I talk to God. He loves me and understands how I feel. I tell him about what made me mad, and he helps me to feel good again. What makes you feel mad? Another thing that makes me feel mad is when a friend comes over and plays too rough with my toys and breaks one. I don't feel mad if she is being careful and has an accident. I feel mad if she does it on purpose. If she says I'm sorry, then I don't feel mad anymore. Well, maybe just a little mad. Dear God, help me to forgive my friend. I don't want to feel mad anymore because it doesn't feel good. Anyway, having a good friend is much better than any toy. Sometimes I feel hurt. Sometimes I feel hurt in my feelings. One time, my big brother didn't want me to play with him and his friend. He said I was too little to do what they were doing. That hurt my feelings. It's not good to have your feelings hurt. Sometimes it feels like it is never going to stop hurting inside. God cares about me, so I always tell him when I feel hurt, he helps me to forget about it. And after a while, my feelings don't hurt anymore. What makes you feel hurt inside? Sometimes I feel hurt in my body. One time I fell down and skint my knee and my elbow. It hurt so much that it made me cry. I don't like being hurt in my body. I think being hurt in my body is worse than being hurt in my feelings. Whenever I hurt myself, I tell mom or dad, and then I tell God, he cares when I am hurt, and he wants me, he wants to make me well. Thank you, God, for healing me and helping me to not hurt anymore. Sometimes I feel sad. Sometimes I feel sad when I lose something. One time my hamster ran away and that made me sad. I only had him for two years, but my mom said this was a long time to have a hamster. So I must have taken very good care of him. I still cried and cried. I'm glad God cares about how I feel because I prayed to him and he helped me to stop feeling sad about losing my hamster. Now I feel happy again. What makes you feel sad? Sometimes I feel sad because of something bad that happened. One time my grandma got sick and now she is not with us anymore. That made me very sad. Grandma was always my good friend. My mom said that grandma is in heaven now with Jesus. She said that we should remember all the good times we had with her. Some people never had a grandma and that makes them sad. God, please help me to remember all the good times I had with my grandma and not feel sad anymore.
Most of the time, I feel happy. Most of the time, I feel happy about everything. I thought of 20 things that make me happy. Sunny days, snowy days, riding my bicycle, playing with friends, reading my books, coloring and painting, being with my family, eating my favorite food, stories about Jesus, sleeping in my bed, playing games, petting animals, running fast, singing, Sunday school, birthdays, Christmas, laughing, helping others, talking to God. Every day I say thank you, God, for my happy life. You make me the happiest of all. What makes you happy? Write down 20 things that make you happy. God cares. Talk to him. God helps me. God loves me. Pray to him. Thank you. The end. Dear God, thank you for being my friend and always understanding how I feel.